Hey y'all, today we're talking about best friends and is it okay if your spouse is not your best friend? And, and what if, what if that best friend is of the opposite sex? So, do you want you want you want to start off? You want me to start off? Of course, your your husband. Well, in my case, the husband, your spouse can have a best friend. Of course, your spouse's best friend can be of the opposite sex, as long as that sex is you. Um, I really don't. I'll speak for myself. I'll let Dewan speak for himself. Dewan's my best friend. Dewan's also my husband. I don't... I can't even say I don't think I would like. I know I would not like. You know, you have a, like really good friends and you're texting your friend and like you could be... Like let's say Dewan's sitting in the chair. He sits in his chair and I'm over on another chair and... I'm texting my best friend. I'm, <laughs> oh my god, you know, I'm just into the text. I'm like, oh shoot, boy, boy, I'm all boying on my no. couch, like, <laughs> no. and he and he like, who you text? Oh, I'm just texting someone, so you know, whatever. No. My boy, my male best friend, that well, you know, it's just Chris. I'm just talking to Chris. Problems. He is, he is, he is so stupid. No, no problems. <laughs> Kiki and ha-ha on the phone with another dude. So what, what mm -hmm. if... I don't, I don't even think that's appropriate. But what if, what if someone like grew up with the person? Like what if you grew up with... Uh, let's just call him Bob. I don't think we know any Bobs. Yeah, we don't you know, know any just, Bobs. So. No, I do know. No, no Bob. Don't, don't worry about it. Okay. So let's say you, you you met Bob before you before you know you met... Well, that's probably impossible. Yeah, because um, we know each other but forever. But let's just say you and Bob was... You know, best friends, you got married. Uh, let's say Bob was in your wedding. Let's say Bob was your man of honor. You know, had a bouquet and everything. Mm -hmm. You know, what, how would you feel then if you knew somebody as long as you knew me and like y'all was cool? And let's say, let's say I was okay with Bob. Like, you know, me and Bob, hey, Bob, you know, mm -hmm. is, that, but... is, that, is that still okay? Bob's in your wedding and he's there as a witness to you tying with someone else. Mm -hmm. Bob can I still expect that he would be that role, he would fit that that role, that position in your life. Mm -hmm. Like he can't or in my in my life. He can't he has to understand, especially if he's cool with you. He can't be like, man, DJ, I know you got married to Nick, man, you know, congratulations, I'm happy for y'all. So but I'm still the best friend. Like, I don't okay. know. Because the one is who I've decided to now be that, be one with. Mm -hmm. Like, I can't be one with you and have a guy who, I, who I'm saying that I enjoy most of, most of my time with or enjoy talking to, spending time with, whatever, another person. That doesn't make sense to me. I mean, I've, I'm investing the rest of my life into this person. So I just don't think that um, it's it's appropriate in a marriage for the uh, your spouse to have a friend, let alone a best friend of yeah. the opposite sex. Like that's just like so no. So and I'm sorry if you don't like your spouse enough for them to be your best friend. You got to work on that. They shouldn't be your spouse. <laughs> if, if that's if that's your your reality, that's unfortunate. So I feel like this. Number one, let's define best friend. Best friend. Best that's, friend. Duh. That's the top most singular person that you uh, confide in. Right. Um, that you can count on. That they can count on you. You drop everything for that person and this and that. Now, I'm not saying that you can't have a best friend and and be married. But I just think that at least your spouse should be a best friend. And if you have somebody maybe of the same sex, like a good girlfriend yeah. you grew up with or something like that, you know, I can understand that. But I would seriously have a problem if you had a best friend that was a male 
regardless. Now you oh, go out with your best friend and it, you it, going out with not, a man. It, it's not. It, it's not jealousy. It's not mm -hmm. that I feel like you would do anything with that best friend. It's just like I'm the I'm the numero uno male in your life. Period. Period. And, and I, I would have a huge problem uh, if you if you had a male best friend now. Uh, females, you know, whatever. <laughs> what? Oh, like I can have yeah, like, like I mean, female I, best friend yeah, that don't yeah. that don't matter. Nah. Yeah. 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 You know. Like I have no problem when you come home and you talk about. You know, I don't even have problem when you come home and you share your day with. Com you share with me conversations that you have with like females at work or whatever. Like I have, I have no problem. It's my issue is not that he cannot talk to a female. Ever like I'm the only female that you talk to. I don't want you talking, looking, nothing, no, no other female but me. Like, no, that's not the case at all. I'm just saying anybody that you confide in, anybody that you run to. Why would you not run to your spouse if you're having any type of issue? Even if that issue what is if, with your I, spouse, I was say, yeah. What if your spouse is the issue? Even if your, even if you your issue, because people say, you know, you know, tell me to my face. You know what what your problem is. You know, be real. Talk to me. But then you gonna go and talk to somebody else? No, talk to your spouse. Let your spouse know what it is that you're dealing with. Yeah. I mean. Now, now. And work it out. You have to. Go now, ahead. now, like like you said though, if your spouse is the problem, if you're getting knocked out at home, if you're getting dragged around that's, the house, yeah, uppercut, uppercut, getting your face, you know, <laughs> smashed into the the counter or whatever. Don't go back, John. You know. Maybe you shouldn't Don't talk to homeboy yeah. or, or, or yeah. homegirl. Not to make light of domestic yeah, violence, no, 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 like no, no, not please. at all. But Don't hit your please spouse. Get e some, either way, either way. Get some. Yeah, then yeah, you can go to someone please, else and please. go Call externally and get some help. Call the Seriously. police. Call the police. But, you know, we are nonviolent. Call the police. Please. But I'm just saying, like, like I told, I told Dewan, um, this might have been before we got married or even... Um, or after we got married, and he has not done this, praise be unto God, but I just thought, I was like, thinking, I don't know why I was thinking about this, but I was like, what would make me mad, get mad at Dewan? And, um, the only thing that I could think of is if I asked him to bring, and this is way before children, but, and I, you know, I've told you this, mm -hmm. if I asked him to bring my kids home something to eat, and he walked in the house with nothing to eat. I saw myself like being so lit, like fire, like breathing fire out my mouth and my ears. Like, why would you not ask you to bring my kids something to eat? You didn't bring, I didn't even ask him to bring me anything to eat, just my children. And he didn't do that. That was the only thing that I saw before getting married that I would be mad at him. So if that ever was to happen, I would probably need time to cool off. But at the end of the day, I would be like, really? Why did but, you but, not but bring something course, to eat? Of course, I would. He would really, never do that. I mean, you know, love the way this guy is the husband and father is not even funny. Like, I amazing, I amazing. Um, so if it's something like that, if you need a breather, take a breather, but don't go out and run to somebody of the opposite sex and be like, and Dewan did this, and you know. I, I I can't stand him, blah blah, blah bad mouthing your yeah, spouse. Yeah, because because then what we'll homie be like, no, no, no. yeah, nah, that's messed up. I would never do that. No, it's like no, thank you. No. I know you would never do no. that. I know you. I know you would never do that. So thinking of what if your best friend is of the opposite sex, but it's homosexual, is that okay? So it's not like it ain't like you gonna run into the arms of him. Hey, look. Um, because he don't want you know how. Um. Is that okay? I, you go before you go to shopping. I I, I, I I just I just want to say God loves everybody. He does. Yeah. God loves everybody. And uh, if if your if your best friend was a male who was who was homosexual to me it wouldn't matter 
that you know whatever way um, that that person's orientation still is not. it's still a male yeah like it's still a man it's, it's still a, it's still a man mm -hmm. so I'm like you know yeah. whatever they do in their personal life don't matter yeah you're you're texting Bob you're laughing and confined to Bob, <laughs> Ooh, Bob so and and I feel like you know that's my job like I'm here for you yeah Bob's not like, yeah you know so yeah yeah and you and you and your spouse will probably get over anything because you're in that relationship. You're in that commitment. So, you'll probably get over it. What about before. you though? What if I had a best friend who was a female who was homosexual? Let's guy. say let's say me and her go to the barber shop together. Don't guy. You know, Don't get the tape. Uh, you know, y'all y'all going y'all going to ball hoop and all. outside. You know, she still got breasts. Family. She still got chesses. She still got. I don't care. They didn't rap her. No, she ain't got. It, it, Look, it, it's it's females out there that ain't going to strap down, ain't going like listen, nothing. I, they, I don't know. Uh, listen, she out there hooping. She got a sports bra on. She 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 got the got got the got the not not the regular basketball shorts on. She got the ones that just come up under the butt cheek. No, like no, she, she probably yeah, she, she she gonna have a no. I'm I'm not the, no the, the, the full blown. No, she ain't got to. She ain't gotta have that. You not gonna be put in that situation. How about that? Yeah, you ain't gonna be put in that situation. I, I I can never like my wife is is my only you know um, person that I would want to confide in. Like she she would know every every last drop about me, and that's that. So um, so regardless if it's a a, a, a best friend, female, male, in yeah. you know, on either side, you know, my wife, my wife is is, is number one um, for me, you know, sharing things with, confiding, and, and everything else. Best friends do, I guess, but I feel like yeah. either way, your spouse should be elevated over any type of any, friend, anybody, any period. Relationship. Like that's your spouse. Like y'all yeah. file taxes together. Yeah. Like <laughs> y'all are one. You yeah, know? I mean, like. You know, so. I don't, yeah, I don't know how you can put anyone besides God above your spouse. Yeah, but in our case, we are each other's. Yeah, and, best and uh, again, this is us. This this is how we see it. Yeah. This is through this is through our perspective of like we said, you know, knowing each other for a long time, uh, being married for seven years. This is how we operate. Yeah, but we know that we are not the only people who who think this way. So. Uh, if you guys, you know, you wanna wanna refute what we say or have instances where you feel like we're wrong, please let, let us, us know. know. I, I want to know because I have no idea. But this is just our perspective. But we may I, be weird. Maybe. Maybe. I, I don't know. I don't know. But uh, let us know in the comments if you guys, you know, think we're tripping or how you guys feel about that. Because maybe. You might have a similar relationship to to us, but you do have a a best friend. Uh, mm -hmm. the, please let me know. And how let does me, that work? Let me know how your husband feels. Yeah, how does that work know. for y'all? I want to know. Yeah. So let us know, and uh, thank you guys for watching, and you'll see us in the next one. Have a beautiful day.